This is Master Gia reporting at Exotica, New Jersey on Saturday with the always beautiful Veronica Rodriguez. How are you doing, Veronica? Hi, guys. I'm great. Thank you. So what made you want to get into the business? Curiosity. I was very curious. And um, of course, the money. But most likely, I wasn't really, I didn't know what I was getting into. But I mean, I kind of got into it afterwards and accepted it. And now I have fun and I enjoy, you know, like I get paid for having sex pretty much. But, what surprised you most about the industry? What's the one? Surprised you the most about the adult industry? Well, you know, um, when I got in the industry, I was I was very young. You know, I was like 19, and I don't think I was mentally prepared for it. So I think that a lot of the girls that you know, new girls that get in the industry and they're like between 18, 19 years old, um, they really don't know what they're getting into. You know, and by the time that I became 21 you know and I started I started realizing you know that what porn has become in my life um, it really affected the relationship with your family you know so that's the only thing I can really say that porn you know great like affected my life but on the other side I have a lot of fun you know I'm more outgoing now um, I love making porn by the way and I love filming while I'm having sex and um, I love entertaining other people and um, I mean I love my job you know. What's a typical day on the set like? <laughs> well makeup done, you pick an outfit and you do a photo shoot uh, with all your outfit and then you take your outfit off and then you pretty much fuck on camera for four hours pictures still different position and then the guy comes and then the whole set is done <laughs> <laughs> I think it's a lot of fun <laughs> tell me a little bit about Veronica Rodriguez productions so I've been in the industry for about almost four years now and um, I wanted to become independent and I wanted to um, step it up you know and become a brand uh, not just be a regular porn star but I wanted to brand myself and um, copyright my name so I created my own um, like I told you I, I love making porn so I produce and direct my own um, porn movies now which is Bureau Productions I have my own porn company and um, right now what I'm doing I'm filming content and I'm going to every single porn convention I've been to every single Exotica and I'm promoting my website that's coming out soon veronicarodriguez.com so that's what it's my production all about um, what makes Latin women so hot well, I think we're crazy, but I mean, um, we're very passionate, you know, like Latin women are very passionate, they're very intense, um, something that I don't think a white woman, I don't think they're very passionate, I don't know. Um, we are crazy, we're wild, and yeah, <laughs> I think it's the passion, it's the absent too, um, I think it's the curves, you know, and um, we definitely stand out. What's your preferred type of guy and girl? Um, I love Latin guys. Um, if they're from Puerto Rico, I love the way they talk. <laughs> and um, I also love, um, I had a couple boyfriends and they were white boys, you know, I love light eyes, like green eyes. So, um, they, of course, they have to be very funny. Most, mo most likely they have to, you know, um, like offer, uh, bring something to the table, you know, and take good care of me and be funny and they have to be very smart, you know, I, I like very smart guys, I can't stand slow people. <laughs> I'm with you on that. What about girls? What do you like in girls? Girls, I think girls are more sweet than guys. Um, I love threesome because I get to have a girl and a guy, so it's like best of both worlds. And, um, a girl is very sweet, very passionate. They kind of, they kind of know how to touch you in the spot that we like, you know. So I think girls know each other more, and I think that's why we get along better. I think, but I mean, I like guys still, you know. I like both. <laughs> Who are your favorite people to shoot with, performers? Um, I love shooting with um, Nikki Delano. I shot her for almost three scenes. Yeah, three scenes for my website that is coming out soon. Um, I also love shooting with Stevie She. She's a new uh, performer. Uh, we shot Apocalypse for Digital Playground, and she's a very smart girl. She knows all the dialogues. 
Um, she's, you know, she's very smart. I love smart people and smart girls. Very hard to find porn stars that have some brain, you know. So um, she's one of those. <laughs> she's one of those that actually is very smart. And um, I love girls that can pick up a, a script like this, you know, and we can shoot and just do the intro and get it over with, you know. Uh, what do you like to do for fun when you're not on a porn set? When I'm not on a porn set, I'm usually featuring dancing. I'm doing a tour in another state. <laughs> so um, I do a lot of pole dancing. I do a lot of appearances. I host a lot of clubs around the United States. So I'm always flying. I'm always booked. Um, now when I get home and um, I'm off, I love to smoke my weed, you know, and watch my funny movies and just sleep and catch up on breath because I need it. I need my beauty sleep. And um, right now, in January, I have to go back to school, so there's no more really free time for me. Could you say something uh, dirty in Spanish for uh, my listeners? Mm, sí, papi, qué rico. Quiero que te vengas en mi cara. Mm. <laughs> That's awesome. Any final words, Veronica? Yeah, mírame, mírame. That's my final words. <laughs> That's her final words, and I approve. <laughs>